Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a really exciting video. Today I'll be sharing with you guys my new Burberry jacket that I got from DHgate. Um, if you would like to see all the details and everything about this, it's like a review of it, um, I will be doing that in this video. There will also be the link to the place where I purchased this from in the description box down below. So I'll link the exact link that I purchased this from out of all the DHgate links. I chose the link that I did because it had loads of positive reviews and so that's why I went with it. First of all, I'll show you the package that it came in. So this is the package. It initially came in this blue parcel. So it's just like a normal parcel bag. And then they wrap the whole bag in like blue sticky tape and then clear sticky tape. So yeah, I just ripped this open when it came. I won't show you the other side because my address is there. But um, yeah, it was just like a bag like this. And then it was really well wrapped. It also came in a layer of bubble wrap. So it was sealed down like that. It was like a little parcel. And then inside the bubble wrap layer, it came in a Ziploc plastic bag. Um, and so it has this detail on it. Um, so it just says this and I got the size small. So yes, I got the size small and I was a little bit worried about it because it seemed from the comments in the reviews on the seller's link that this like it was like, wait, let me say again. It seemed like from the reviews on the seller's link that it was like it ran small, but I got the size small and it fits me perfectly. So I was so relieved. Anyway, I'll show you the jacket now. Um, I will show you all the details and then I'll try it on for you at the end so you can see what it looks like on my frame. Um, so I chose this color. They have a load of different colors on this particular seller's link and they have a load of different sizes as well. So if you want to get a different size or a different color, you can. Um, they are all the same length, however. So this is what the jacket looks like overall. And I'll show you how long it is once I put it on. But I'll work from the top of the jacket down to the bottom. At the top, it does have um, this little chain here. It has the sizes. So it says UK size 4, USA size 2, Italy size 36, and German size 32. On the inside of the jacket, it has the classic Burberry plaid. And then it also has um, this chain. It says Burberry London England over here. And then it also has this tag that says Burberry on it. It has an extra button, which is exactly the same as all the other buttons, which I'll show you later. And then it has this tag here, which says Burberry London, England. And then on this side, it has um, by appointment to Her Royal Majesty Queen Elizabeth II Waterproofers Burberry Limited Edition. By appointment to her His Royal Highness, the Prince of Wales Outfitters Burberry Limited Edition. So that's what that says there. Ooh, very fancy. Um, anyway, going down from there, all of the inside is just the same. It has just that plaid on the inside and then it has a split at the bottom. Okay, I'll go over the outside of the jacket now. So it has the collar. On the inside of the collar, it does have the Burberry plaid if you pop it up. Um, I will wear it probably popped down though, so you probably won't see that, but it does have that detail on the inside. On the neck of the collar here, it does have this little clip. This is really sturdy and decent quality, um, and it's a very thick clip, so it clips together there if you want to. Uh, this clip is like really decent and sturdy. It's very like decent golden kind of metal. I'm not sure what this is made of, but it's sewn in really decently, and this feels very sturdy. Like this is a very well-made jacket. It has all these buttons going down the side here, so it's like, I think it's called double breasted. And it also has all these details up the top. I think it'll be easier to show you the details of the buttons once I'm actually wearing it, but it has buttons all the way down the inside and all the way over here. Also on the inside of the jacket, there are like these little buttons as well as some other larger buttons on the inside. So you can like do it up all the different ways that it buttons up all together. Wait, are those buttons? Maybe those aren't buttons. These look like buttons to me, but they're on the opposite side of the large buttons, so maybe they're just there to hold the big buttons in place. I don't really know how it works. Anyway, um, going down, the sleeves are like this. I'll put my arm through it so I can show you. Um, it has this like buckle through the sleeve, and then you can adjust the sleeves tightness through like tightening this little mini belt on the sleeves, if that makes sense. Um, and it has one, two, three, four little rings there that you can adjust it for different sizes, and then it also has these pockets and these pockets are closed by a button, but they are of course like actual working pockets. If you want to like put some stuff in there, they go down to like here. So they're really roomy. Okay. I'm going to put the jacket on because I feel like I'm not like explaining it very well when it's not on my body. It's kind of hard to hold it all up. Um, 
It also has, sorry, I'm just like literally in my pajamas. Um, it also has this tie that goes around the waist. So the tie, you can tie it however you want and it also has this buckle. So you could like tie it through like a proper belt or you could just tie it in a loop just casually if you're running out the door. It's really cute. This is a really sturdy coat. Um, the length on the sleeves is like this on me. It's literally perfect. Um, I am five foot four and a half and um, I got the size small if you're wondering again. So um, yeah, the size small fits me perfectly. Um, on my frame, I don't think it is like too tight. It fits my shoulders like literally perfectly. Um, so I hope that helps someone. So the buttons can be done up all the way if you want. Let me just undo this. So if I wanted to, I could do up all these buttons all the way to the top if I wanted. Like this. I'll just do one up as an example. Um, and it's really nice. I could probably fit like a jumper under here, but it would probably start becoming kind of tight. Um, I don't imagine I would like layer this with a lot of other coats though, just because um, I did get like literally my perfect size. Um, if you wanted to layer a lot of things, I would recommend going a size up, but like you can kind of get the vibe from like that of how it would be with stuff on it. So it has all these buttons. So if you wanted to button this to out here or something like that, you can like rearrange all these different ways. Also, um, this buttons down to here, if that makes sense. I'm like trying to show you all the different functions. It has this random little like flap that I think buttons on one of these. There's so many different like buttons and flaps that it like it has all the bells and whistles is what I'm trying to say. Um, but yeah, I'll stand on my chair now so that I can show you the length. This is what it looks like from behind. I hope you can see. And then this is the length on me. So it's like just above the knee kind of thing. Um, it's not too short, not too long. Um, and then also I'll take it off to show you one more detail on the back because it does also have like this detail on the back, which I think is really cute. I'm just so obsessed with this jacket. I will be inserting at the end, like the, um, price point and like screenshots of the seller's link if you're interested in the details and stuff. Um, but yeah, this is what the back of the jacket looks like. It just has this one button to undo. Um, if you want to like, I don't know, let in air, make it a little bit more breathable. Let me undo it so that I can show you the inside. So that's what the back of the jacket looks like. It's just like a little flap there that goes over. I'm not really sure what that's for. Um, also, this jacket has these little um, loops on the side. I'm not sure what these are called, sorry. I don't know what all the bells and whistles are called on the jumper. I mean, on the jacket. I think this is totally removable. Yeah, it is. So you can actually take both of these little things off and completely remove this tab if you want to. I'm just going to leave it on because I think it looks nice on, but you could remove that if you wanted to. I'll also show you a close up of the button. Hopefully my phone camera will focus, but it just says Burberry Burberry. You can kind of see it just says Burberry Burberry in running riding going around the button and all of the buttons look exactly like that. So that's what the buttons look like up close. Um, the details are all gold and I'm trying to see if there's anything else I'm forgetting to tell you guys. Nope. The reason I got this one is I just thought it was like the most classic Burberry coat that I could imagine. Like if I dreamed of like my dream trench coat, this is like my dream classic trench coat. Um, so that's why I chose this colorway and this style. Um, I like the length of it. I feel like it's most um, appropriate for my lifestyle and stuff. Um, I'll also tell you how many loops, not loops, how many eyelet holes there are. There's one, two, three, four, five, six. There are six eyelet holes. And the buckles on both the belt and the little things on the arms are um, with like gold hardware and are kind of coated in like a leathery material, if that makes sense. So they're not just a plain buckle, they're kind of coated. Um, overall, I think this was like a really good purchase. I think it's really stunning. I'm excited to wear it and it's really like decent feeling it doesn't feel like i was worried it would come and be a really thin cheap feeling coat this feels very decent it doesn't feel cheap at all um it feels very sturdy very well made um yeah it looks very nice in person it doesn't feel like cheap or anything and i'm really excited to wear it i'll put it just over the top and i'll talk you through the outro so yeah um here is what it looks like on open again to get an overall vibe um, and yeah, you can button that up of course as well, but, um, I'm just gonna sit here cause it's kind of warm right now. Um, but I'll stick in here the little, um, like screenshots that I have 
of it from the DHK sellers website. If you want to see all the details, I'll stick that in here. This screenshot is of the listing that I purchased from. It took me a while to find a listing that I was like satisfied with how the quality of it looked from all the reviews. I always read the reviews when I'm buying on DHgate and this one looked really good. Here are the size options and also of course the different colors it comes in and this is a screenshot of my receipt with my size, color, and how much I paid. I can't recall exactly, but my order only took two weeks or a little bit less to arrive, which is fast to Australia. So here are some of the closer up looks at the details. So it says Burberry, London, England. It has this really decent feeling chain on the top. It's not a very, very heavy chain, but it's like decent, the sizes. Um, let me show you a close up of the button. It says Burberry over there. Hopefully you can see that. Let me just, there we go. Um, over here, this is what the little um, metal details look like. They're really nice and decent. On the other side, you know, it's very nice. Um, and then of course the little tag, it looks like this. Just trying to focus there you go and then on the inside oh wait the other side says Burberry like this and then I'll show you the inside it's just plain and this is embossed and then it of course comes on a little Burberry tag like this oops that's upside down Burberry and then this is an extra button which is the same as the one I just showed you earlier I'm just thinking is there any other detail that I should show you guys oh yeah I forgot to show you guys this one so this is the little um, tag so you can pause if you'd like to read any of the details um, there we go and then it's got this one on the inside so those are all like the washing instructions and everything if you want to pause it let me open this up so you can see on the inside Hopefully that's all the details you can see. Um, yep, yeah, that's the little instructions on the inside. That's all the tag, all the bells and whistles. This is the pockets on the pockets on the inside are the plaid material as well. And that's everything. There we go. Yeah, and here's a detail of the stitching going down the tie, a close up of the actual, I don't know what to call this buckle. And then the paneling on the sides is very nicely done as well like that. Paneling is really nice on this jacket. Here's a better, more like full body view of what the jacket looks like on. So it would cross over like this. This actually goes either here or on this button if you like button it all the way up. Um, and then all of these buttons can button over here. And this button detail here goes to this button over here. Now that I've like stood up and like seen myself in a full length mirror, it makes a lot more sense which button connects with which other button. Um, and of course you can always check online to see how other people have like buttoned this up and like tied it and stuff. Um, and you can tie it and like, yeah, it's really cute um i've gotten so many compliments wearing it already and i love it here's the back here's the front i love i love it so yeah those are all the details of the jacket um if you liked this video please give it a big thumbs up if you're gonna get the same jacket as me let me know in the comments down below and tell me what color you're getting if you get the same color as me we can be twins or get whatever color suits you there's it's like there's some really cute colors um i just felt like this was the most burberry classic vibes for myself personally but I won't judge you if you get another color, it's fine. Um, subscribe if you'd like to see more content from me. I upload literally all the time and I'll catch you next time. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.